she home alone? Nerving. Um, oh. Ah! Hello everyone, welcome back to another scary video. We're fun for AJ and today's video is by the channel Fearsome Top 5. And it's called Top 8 Scary Ghost Videos of Truly Terrifying Encounters. So you know what to do. Grab your popcorn, get comfy, and enjoy the show. Pillow, cause I am scared. Welcome to Fearsome Top 5. Reddit user Federal Entertainer 21 bought a house in North Wales back in 2018. This home was built in the 1850s and has a long history behind it. Well, a few years later, while he was doing some landscaping in the garden, he accidentally discovered a dead body beneath. After oh, out, you're right. He identified it as a well that he oh, oh Samara. Years. But when he used a pickaxe to crack it open, why? No you need to leave these things alone. When something's buried like this, yeah. it's buried for a reason. Wait, it's on screen? Yeah, I know. What the as heck? he cracked open the well, a ghostly scream came from inside. It got out. It's like a little girl. This haunting scream echoed throughout the well and sounded like the voice of a young girl. At the time, this man wasn't afraid, but rather puzzled as he had no idea who or what was causing this sound. I don't know. Do you think it was added in post? I mean, it could be. It's, okay, we don't even know what happened afterwards. You you cracked it open. You supposedly heard it. Then what? You just get ended like that? <laughs> Goes by Grass Valuable posted a video asking if anyone thinks he caught something paranormal. According to this user, on the 20th of July, he went to an open house of a place that was built in 1891. Oh my god. Stop going all these old room to room. He was the only person inside. His wife wasn't able to make it, so he began recording on his phone to give her a good look at the interior. Right. When he later oh, so he didn't catch it when he first recorded it? The attic, right? As he walked into the room and panned the camera from right to squatter. left, a chilling disembodied voice was caught. What if it was just him making that laugh? It would sound like a laugh, right? <laughs> like, <clears throat> or something like that. I don't know. I sound like a some goofy laugh or something. <laughs> Does sound like? I don't know what it is. They're clearing their throat. This bizarre noise almost sounded like a distorted laugh. And Why would you enough, put a clown? The recording claims that he didn't hear this at the time. People in the comments said it simply sounds like the person recording oh. breathing heavily. Who breathes like that? <laughs> that there was one thing I thought of when I heard this noise. No, a Scooby Doo. No, I don't know. <laughs> oh, I thought he was gonna play a Scooby Doo villain. Works at a hospital and has had plenty of interesting experiences while on the job. Of course. Well, according to this Reddit user, about four to five years ago, the clinic staff at the hospital were taking a few photos. But as they closely examined the pictures they took, they noticed something unsettling. What? Oh, there's... Oh, what the heck? Reflection on the floor. A faint silhouette can be seen standing behind the wheelchair. What? This eerie transparent figure looks to be holding the handles of the wheelchair. Yeah. He's possibly wearing a hospital gown. This terrifying sight is undeniably the outline of a person, but clearly there's no one behind the wheelchair. Sentry Tuna Lover claims this photo is 100% real. I think that's terrifying. Guys, let us know. Can ghosts show reflection? Because I, I know sometimes they, they say they can't cast shadows or something. So can they have a reflection? I don't know. Hey, vampires can't. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I only have movie knowledge of this. Talk, a woman named Rosanna has meticulously documented I think anyone has real vampire. She's had in her apartment. There's vampires in New Orleans. That's what they say on TikTok. With. Guys, do you believe that? <laughs> Touch it. Uh. 
feel like there should be like a hand that goes like this behind the door. <laughs> oh my god. Like she's breathing. Oh. You think it's just the wind, like her moving? Where's the sink to wash your hands? You just go out the bathroom, you're good. You go somewhere else to wash it. Imagine. Oh. Rosanna began recording after hearing banging coming from her apartment that she couldn't explain. But as she turned around, the scooter hauntingly rolled towards her. She cautiously stepped closer, moving the scooter back in place, when suddenly a bang came from behind her. A few days later, as she laid in bed, she began to hear footsteps walking in the hallway. Ooh. So dark. Gosh. Ah. Oh. Looks like it's still cracked open, right? Yeah. Oh, you're gonna go check it out. Ooh. Looks like a kid's room. Yeah, it does. Is she home alone? Irving. Um, oh. ah! <laughs> As That's crazy. The, hallway, the door to the room across from her unnervingly closed on its own. She gathered her courage and went to take a look inside, proving that no one was in the room. But as she stood in the doorway, the clothing rack suddenly lunged towards her. Five like, days later, what? once again looking into the hallway, she Another witnessed one? something that made her hair stand on end. Oh, what? Wait, is she home alone all these times? The room looks different now. Right? Maybe. It's been a while. They rearranged it. Oh. Look under there. I think you should just throw everything away. gonna move huh I know ah! what Gosh. as the tiny rocking horse began to move uh. back and forth she made her way over scanning the room and showing that nothing was attached to the horse to make it move and as she stepped away from the room the lights once again began aggressively flickering According to Rosanna, all this activity led her to contact a priest to rid this spirit from her apartment. Oh, yeah. Hours after this priest left and Rosanna was trying to sleep, things took what? a horrific turn. That's the worst fear. You try to get someone to help you cleanse the house and they make it worse. Oh, what do you do then? Is that a doll? Nokia? Yeah. Someone's using the toilet. What if it follows her in this room? Stop. <gasps> Why did you say that? Gosh. <laughs> I did. Flash warning. Oh, do we see this one? It seems familiar. Oh no! It's like even worse since a priest went there. No, stop. This is literally a horror movie. Sounds like an ice cream truck. 
Why? I'd faint. <laughs> Number five. 16 years ago on a YouTube channel called Double Bins, a video was posted of a terrifying encounter caught on camera. On a sunny day back in 2008, two teenagers decided to explore a local abandoned house. This house had clearly been left untouched for years, piquing their curiosity. Let's go. We seen the this too? This looks familiar. Uh, we go in the Can you imagine, like, your kid goes somewhere, gets gets spooked, and brings it back to the house? No. Oh my god, I would be so mad. Oh. Or you know how like those ghost hunters <laughs> bring it back to their family? No. Their garage is that. Yeah, that's like a warehouse. Yeah. Look at the roof, Potato quality. I know. Where? That should be super clear. <laughs> oh, yeah. Look at that. There's an oven door. Where? In the middle of the living room. <laughs> the roof is off. <gasps> oh, oh, my. oh, he saw it. Oh, my. Go, go. I, I could have I saw a person. Squatter? Dude, there's a person. Yeah, like, oh. no feature. There's, like, solid yeah, there black. Like a, yeah, like shadow. Like a shadow. Yeah. Shadow figure. As the guy holding the camera angled it up towards the roof, a sinister dark figure was caught walking by. The shadowy figure unexpectedly walked across, immediately catching his attention and sending him running. Because of the potato quality of this video, it's hard to tell if this could potentially be paranormal or possibly just a person lurking in the old house. Either way, Either way both possibilities are equally terrifying. Yeah. As living people freak me out more than ghosts. That is true. Number six. This is equal for on me. On a small YouTube channel called May 091985, only one video was ever posted. As a hiker was trudging through a hilly area, One they video. stopped and their eyes widened in disbelief at what they saw in the sky. With their fingers slightly trembling, they grabbed their phone and aimed it towards the sky, and this is what they caught. Magneto. <laughs> For Saint Joe. people leave his shells and they feel cursed after i don't know i mean it does look like a person or something floating they stared at the mountain in front of them their hearts skipped a beat at the sight of a strange black silhouette suspended in the sky with this peculiar anomaly eerily looks like a person somehow floating among it's the magneto above. it's like <laughs> if we take a closer look this is clearly not a plane helicopter or drone and throughout this entire 30 second video, this unidentified object remained completely still. Wait, it's, it looks it's not like it's, floating down? Or is it just clouds moving? Oh. I don't know. In September of 2023, a video was posted to Facebook that caught the attention of 1.3 million people. Ooh, With over 20,000 okay. likes, viewers have struggled to explain what was caught in this footage. A man named Jarek is a taxi driver from the Philippines. Oh, yeah. He's driving late one him. night when he spotted a woman waiting for a lift by the side of the road. He pulled over to pick her up, but what happened next still haunts him till this day. That's crazy. Mm -hmm. What if he was just acting this out the whole time? Ooh, really good actor then. <laughs> I don't know. Philippines has a lot of ghost stories. Can you imagine in his eyes she looked normal too? Yeah, that's weird. Well, I don't know. I, I mean, he didn't say anything that yeah. she looked different, so. <laughs> what 
What do you do at that point? Wow. So you're right. She looked completely normal. I wonder what would happen if he actually went there. I don't know. Or what if it, since he didn't bring her, now he's cursed? Don't say that. Come oh, on. man. There's so many possibilities. Leave this man alone. He's already traumatized. <laughs> That's crazy, though. And Jared claims to have seen a woman wearing a white and purple dress enter the vehicle. But after cruising down the road for a short time, he glanced at his mirror and discovered that no one was in his back seat. Brick is adamant that a woman entered his car that night and firmly believes that this video is proof of a paranormal I believe encounter. It. He looked genuine. Back in December of 2009, a video was uploaded by YouTube user Amar419. While at work at Sawyer Elementary School, located in Chicago, a man named Dave headed to the boiler room to help a fellow employee. When he got to the basement, a woman named Evelyn was clearly shaken up and explained that she witnessed a door slam shut on its own. Clearly afraid, she asked Dave to take a look. Luckily, he thought to start recording just in case anything else happened. I would have been gone. All right, I'm with Evelyn Sims. We're using this recording here uh, due to a statement. She says that there's been things in the back area that have been. All right, explain to us what happened, Evelyn. I want to get my supplies. I don't want to go Well, I'm here. I'm here now. Oh, don't worry. That's... All right. What? So what happened? But don't just shit on this office and sit back yourself, Dave. <laughs> I don't know if I'm going to go. I don't feel All right. like I'm going to go back there. All right, hang on, hang on. Yeah. I don't want to go back there. Let me just take a look. Now, you say what happened now? This door shit by itself. <laughs> itself, Dave. I'm looking, but I'm not going back there either. What, you scared? Oh, the door's closed. I mean, it was open? It was open and it just slammed back. Let me see if I that is scary. So she in that room? Right. Yeah, look go, at go, it. Go your, your, whatever your material is. Man, he's still making her go back. There. I know. I don't think I want to go there. Come on, come on, go ahead. <laughs> Everyone, just go. No, no, no. You go. She's she, like, nope. She's I'm, clearly right. I'm distressed. Right. I'm recording. I'm, I'm, right, I'm right go, here. Fool. I see the door. All right, go get your stuff. I'm right here. Don't be. Oh, she left her. Okay, she left her stuff there. Okay. Is there anybody back here? Go ahead. No. <laughs> ah! Oh my. Oh my God. That's why she didn't want to go. No way. No Hold <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, Dave. She's like, I don't need my stuff that badly. Bonus. A Reddit user called Miss Hallie Ann says that one day while she was scrolling through Facebook, she came across a post from a friend that caught her eye. According to her friend, a motion notification from her security camera suddenly lit up her phone. What? Oh my gosh. At 922 p.m., what looks like a baby running by can be the seen. The deformed the baby. The image of this tiny infant definitely caught her off guard and left oh her Oh my gosh. Unsettled. She immediately ran to her porch to see if she could find the small child. But don't but open the door. No signs of anyone or anything outside. Fearful that there was now a lost toddler, she called the fire department to come investigate. But after thoroughly searching the area and using a heat-seeking drone on the nearby lake, they were unsuccessful at finding anything. And to make things even creepier, this eerie baby only appeared in one frame of the video. Oh, I don't need those answers. Yeah, we don't need any answers to those questions. We're good. <laughs> what you guys think of the videos? Which one was the scariest for you? Let us know in the comment section below. And again, it would really help us out if you share, like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys later. See you guys.